All right, so we are back into Hogwarts Legacy. Last we left off, we just finished. Uh, uh, what's the uh, Adelio uh, spell where we can pull items to us now? Uh, so our next objective is to head into the Transfiguration classroom and meet up with Professor Wesley. Uh, I still have no idea how to solve that door puzzle where you got that where you got to like roll some items. I still don't know what's the meaning of the how to solve that. Uh, Revelio. Uh, I think we'll come back to that at some point. Right now, we are just gonna focus on uh, on the main quest here. As you can see here, it's getting looking absolutely beautiful as always. Uh, let me give that globe there just a good spin. All right, so it looks like we're all going the right way. So it's been a little while since we played the game, so might be just a little bit rusty. Yeah, I do remember the, the talking gargoyle. I, I do remember that. Alright, we're gonna have to go out here to the courtyard. Alright, here we go. And go over here. Uh, apparently, there is something right here. Apparently, there's a chest right here? Or is it below? Oh, the cat. We have to pet the cat, though. <laughs> Let's pet that cat. So I do got this new neck wear, this little scarf I'm wearing. Supposedly gives me a little bit of bonus stat, so that is the reason why we are wearing it. So it looks like this is the place we gotta meet up with Dr. Wesley. Off on another adventure, are we? Yes indeed. Alright, this is where we gotta go. Let's begin our quest, shall we? What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? Uh, has Professor Fig said anything? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Uh, Ronan did mention something Professor about that. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier. We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Oh, I like the sound of that. Uh... Well, can you tell me more about the, the potion shop here? Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor Sharp asked that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. Okay. Uh, spellcraft, tell me about it. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. That is the next thing that we need to learn, transf uh, transfiguration. And I guess we're going to get our own wand as well, because we are using a borrowed wand, to say the least. Uh, is there any Oliver, uh, Ollivanders out there? What the heck is that? I need to know. There's an Ollivanders in Hogsmeade. There something? is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman 
And okay, it's just a guy that makes maker. really good wines. I trust no one else to pair me with a woman. <laughs> good to know. Good to know. I'm ready to go. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. Right, so that's our I'd next like you to make stop. Hogsmeade. The village with a class. That's the outskirts of Hogwarts. Your bearings. Perhaps right. Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. oh, we could actually choose. Okay, uh, let's take with Natsai with us. Uh, it seems like we have a little bit of a connection there. Sebastian, I'm not sure about him yet. Seems a little bit fishy. I think he's the one that asked us about that illegal duel. Let's bring our Nansai with us. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. A butterbeer? Never heard of something like that. Hey, we got to report to Professor Ronan. Uh, before we do that, let's look We're around. <gasps> we got a field guide there. Okay, so speak to Professor Ronan to receive your first assignment. It sounds like a type of quest given to you by Hogwarts Professor that when complete will reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the men and the mending charm Reperio, which is required to complete other quests. Okay, good to know. Alright, well let's collect this. Partial transfiguration. This partially transfigured teacup, likely the soon to be reverse era of a second year, serve as a Cautionary tale for those who do not take seriously the capacity and danger of transformation. So it looks like that teacup has been turned into partially a rat, which is <laughs> that's not good. If that happened to a person, that would be really, really bad. Uh, do we miss anything else? Revenio. Are we missing anything else here? Don't mind me taking the money. <laughs> Level one lock. We can't really unlock that. Can we talk to uh, Professor Resley? No. Don't mind me uh, just uh, nosing around. <laughs> but I think we're good though. Uh, I think we're all good too. Let's see, always good to check around. Nice little room you have too, by the way. All right, so let's check out. Che uh. So it looks like Professor Ronan is, is right there. Okay. Okay, hold on. We do got another. What is this icon here? Okay, so learn repair from Professor Ronan, so we can't go there yet. We need to like, uh, learn ancient magic throw and ancient magic. So it looks like we gotta do this task here. So let's report to Professor Ronan. See what he has to ask ah, for us there to you do. Are. Hey, how's it going? You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Rapero in no time. All right. Uh, let's ask him what is the purpose of all this task. Probably for us to, you know, get better at casting a spell, get us graduated, our hard Why must you know? first complete tasks to learn Rapero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience. And these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. Okay, I'll do it. I'll start on the task right away, Let's Professor. All right, so collect the flying prison near the broken statue. I do remember a sage. This okay. is the right area. Give it out. <laughs> collect the flying prison defense against the dark power. Dark Arts Tower, which we gotta go up here a little bit. Okay. 
this is this is seems a little bit. Page must be around here. So. Oh. Brilliant. Easy, easy. Professor Ronan, that is absolutely nothing, my friend. But you gotta give me something harder than that. I trust that was the nothing. preliminary tasks weren't too much trouble. Easy. I completed Easy the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Right, I think this is where we gotta learn the spell. Remember, yes. your wand is a conduit of your okay, magic. Okay, so this one's different. Gotta press F and space, space. Alright, Lucario, let's do it. Do it. Uh. Oh god. I'm messing up. I'm messing up. I'm messing up. Oh! Oh! That's so close! -hoo -hoo -hoo. Did not realize you can control that with the mouse so sensitively. But we got it! Reperio, we can fix stuff now. The men in charm repair can be used to mend broken objects and pieces of the environment. Excellent. So we can repair That's bridges it. with that. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly oh, symbolized about that one right heartbreak. There? Okay. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Excellent. Yeah. Easy stuff. All right, let's fix okay. this. We're parallel. Well. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? Nice. Good as new. Look at that. Good as new, although it doesn't look really that pleasant, though. Like, what? Uh, do we gotta fix something else on this side here? What's up? I think we're, I think we're good, yeah. We learned everything we needed. We don't need to talk to him. I think we can actually... Can actually do the quest here. And to Hogsmeade. That's the next place we gotta hit. That will give us ancient magic, ancient magic grow. I do like that. I am using a, key, a new keyboard, so some of the button placement are a little bit different. Oh, that's definitely not the right way to go. All right, I forgot you can sprint in this game. But I probably don't need, oh, look at that. Nice little wind effect on my uh, outfit. Excellent. Okay, okay, we're good. Keep it, keep it over here. Try to hide from me. So we got a key right there. Got more. See, this is the one I, I don't really get. So we got one right here. Let's We're do Rebellio. So not sure where's the other one is at. Oh! Uh, we got that one already. I saw you moving there, Mr. Knight. Don't try to trick me. Yeah, this is the one I really don't get. Cause it's all based on uh, animals here, as you see. And I'm gonna assume the next one is in here, but it is locked, so we can't really use that. Yeah, so don't get the meaning of how that works. Rebellion. Oh yeah, there is something right here. Well, 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 field guild page, central hall fountain. This overnight fountain features an uh, integrally carved statue design of the magical world, including a set of stone signs encircling the fountain's base. Oh, there's more of the butterfly thing right here. This cannot possibly be as difficult as it seems. Oh, Le Lenora Evelyn, do you need any help hello. here? I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello, I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting i never noticed it before if i know hogwarts and i do an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason there's something more to this oh i already i've already solved something like this already lady but i'm gonna pretend i don't know about it uh have you learned anything about it have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it i did discover that casting lumos has an effect of some kind but i'm not sure what to do next Gotta find the big ass butterfly and then put it back into the painting. Are there any more like Are that there here? Any other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. 
I could take a look. If I have the time, I, I, look. I, I know I've how it dreaming. works. <laughs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Okay, so she's giving him up. Do look. come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. Look, it's this Lumos. You get this, right? This spot must be a clue. I should look around in case so, it's nearby. So is that the bottom looks like? So could be down here somewhere. Revelio. Oh, we can cast this. Let's see, now we can't get this. The level one lock. So is there a statue of some sort? Sorry. Don't mind me. Let's see, is it up here? I'm gonna check down here real quick. Ah. Gotta be down here. This looks like the location from the painting. Yeah, follow what could me. Be so special about. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Follow me. I have already done this already. Easy stuff. Already figured this out long time ago. Revenge. There we I go. Knew there was a connection. That's I should tell the Nora that I solved the puzzle of that oh. empty frame. Yo, Paige, let's get that. Nice. Get that X. Nice little juicy XP. Hey, Lenora, guess what? Easy stuff. Get over here. Don't try to hide from me. All right, Lenora. Good news. Lenora, I solved, solved it. Mystery of that painting. Already before it. How? I followed the clues. I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to overexplain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. Easy stuff. The moth. I should have seen that. Easy stuff. Hey, I should notice her. Hey, we level up. We got some health. Excellent. Nice. Side mission relationship. Oh, Mr. Guitar Man here. Sub to Mr. Katara man. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. See, this is what really impresses me is how to get all this rendered in the game. Cause it's clearly a 2D, right? It's clearly 2D. But then they somehow make it look so good. Like I don't know how they did it, guys. Look at this. This is all moving the background. All real time. Which is crazy, guys. This is crazy. Revenue. Let's say I don't know how they got it, how they got it done, but you know, it's really. What the hell was that? Oh, the dragon. So it looks like we already been here, ready. I'm just kind of looking around real quick. So go to Hogsmeade. We're gonna have to go this way. Looks like. What the heck? Oh. I still don't get it. Don't worry. It wasn't that funny. If I last remember watching the Harry Potter movies, the mermaids were not exactly friendly. I uh, uh, forgot which part was it, but the mermaids were not friends, that's for sure. Well, hello, we got another side mission sp really potential here. Uh, Cressida? Cressida Bloom. What Is seems to be the problem? Right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way. Cressida, that's I'm how you pronounce it. I'm not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation. Because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it seems a lot of work just to carry that books. That sounds a rather complicated way to simply avoid carrying your books. Possibly, but where's the fun in simplicity? New charms and spells have to well, come from someone. Some Gryffindor, Why not me? The, I collect the, the books and remove from. the charm myself. Except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Why didn't me telling you? Yeah, that sounds a little bit weird. He sounds like a nice guy. Why did Unless he doesn't like Gryffindor. Madame Scribner that they were your books? 
Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Amit spends a lot of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. Okay. If I have time, I, I would take I a look help. at him. If I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Okay, so where is this library? So it's going to be downstairs, looks like. Uh, it looks like we might have to go to here. This, I think this is the library, which we have never been to. Oh, yep. I'm going to have to use Akio to get to those books. <laughs> get you Got it. back here. Only four more to go. Oh, this, this is easy. Easy Rebellion. stuff. Any stuff here to find? Give the globe a little spin. Uh, there is some sort of note here. We'll get the webcam back here. Uh, Professor Black, my eyes suggest a ban on magic in the library. Someone has been sneaking into the restricted section and and uh, Cressida Bloom seemed to think of the library as her own personal arena in which to practice her latest incarnation. It is most popular. One might consider peace to attain by comparison to such uh, antics. Okay. Uh, that will be the librarian lady be like, I'm tired of this bull crap. Oh. Get your ass over here. This must be Cressida's diary. I'd want this back too if I were uh, I guess we're going to read it because this is going to be the only time we read it. Uh, today was a good day. This is entirely gallery splash. Whatever ridiculous uh, concussion he was creating all over my perfectly sold last week file. I had to empty my entire cauldron and saw it all over again. He is such a uh, menace. He thinks he knows everything, everything there is to know about potion, always disrupting Professor Sharp's class with his experiment. I'm literally convinced that if if it wasn't Professor Risley Nefri, he would have been expelled by now. I could perhaps smoke again tonight for dinner. I'm becoming more uh, partial to them now, although I still prefer meat pie. Uh, sorry I read your uh, diary. You don't need to know about <laughs> your ass over here. Cassandra's book, uh, book. I do see one more up there. Yeah. Wait, there's still one more. There's still one more? You kidding me, Dice? Rebellion. Okay, I guess there's still. Oh, fast travel time. Yes. What are you up to now? Nothing. You better shut your mouth. <laughs> Not doing nothing. Uh, there is some sort of note here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Rebellion. Did not mean to do that. <laughs> Lock. What the heck, guys? Okay, so I think the last one I saw was up here, so we gotta get up here. And uh, let's try to get that last page. Or oh, last book. That's a big ass place, too. Alright, alright, alright. Oh! There he is. It's gonna go in everywhere. It's gonna come back here, or we're gonna keep staying that side. So it might come back here. Nope, it's gonna stick around there. Okay. Come over here. Come over here. Heads up, heads up. No, 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 no. Get over here. <laughs> That's the last book. There we go. We I'll got it. Take them back to Cressida. That's what. Alright, let's look around here for some potential stuff. Spin the glow for good luck. Akio. No, we're not gonna do that again. Oh, field guide. XP. Nice. The old librarian, one of the first librarians of Hogwarts, it deciphered here. Rumor is that he had no tolerance whatsoever for noisy students. It was known for his liberal use of the silencing charm at the slightest sneeze. Wow. So he'd be like, and everybody just shut the heck up. <laughs> that will be him. Oh, look, he is still moving still. What the hell? The hell am I hearing? Okay. Well, let's head back down and uh, give the books back to good old uh, uh, Cressida. See, we, I think we got everything we want to eat it. Okay. There you go. Got your books. Got your stuff back. Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. 
There we go. Here you are. I'm not gonna. Well, I'm not gonna blackmail her. I certainly won't be practicing any well, charms in the library her? again anytime soon. Now to work out where I went wrong. Perhaps I should start brushing up on my Latin. Thank goodness some people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me reading my diary. Oh, but I did read your diary. <laughs> I certainly did. I certainly did read your diary. All right. So next stop. Oh, got chest there. Oh, I did not mean to do that. I'm sorry, people. I'm sorry. Oh, got some gold. Spend that for good luck. All right. Well, next stop. Uh, we're definitely gonna be heading out to Hogsmeade to get our stuff. Hopefully, no more distraction. Rebellion. I think we're all in the green here. Spend that for another good luck. We gotta meet, meet Natty. Some sort of chest there. War just. Alright. Not, not too much here. Always good to explore. You never know what you're gonna find. Yeah, I'm not sure this is where we're supposed to be. Well, it's to definitely go back out, looks like. Okay. At least we got our mission track, so we know the right direction to go. Looks like we're going out this way. That's a weird looking door. Oop. Ow, man. Well, well, well. You... You thought you could hide yourself? A nice. Okay, our first secret right there, everybody. All right, let's see what's here. Rebellion. Oh, wow, even the knights uh, are alive. <laughs> Hearing a little ding and dings. Gotta be something on this side here. I wouldn't bother yourself about that. All right. Okay. Oh, there's something ding in here. Revelio. Hey, there it is. Wooden cat. This wooden uh, statue bears like likeness of Pongo Don, Phyllis Philin, Mouse Hunter, and devoted study companion. Some more lore here. Oh, we got a ghost. Hey, how's it going, everybody? How's it going? Oh. So this is where we Hello. gotta go. Looking for me? Yeah, hold up. No. Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to I have your ready. own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Well, I wasn't ready. What the heck, Dice? I was going to get that field guide page. Okay, I guess we're going to Hogsmeade, everybody. Going to Hogsmeade. We'll see how this goes. Hey, okay. I get, yeah, I was I, glad Professor Weasley I, asked me to accompany I you. I guess we're going to Hogsmeade. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a butterbeer in the village. <laughs> the butter timing beer. of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. All right, I guess we're heading out. Yep, yeah, we're heading out into the boonies. Wow, look at this. <sighs> I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooked wow, up Wow, this looks amazing, rooms. everybody. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. I believe you. Look at this. I suppose this you would not really cool. call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. No, that's something you don't, you don't see something every day. <laughs> Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. All right. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. Look at that. Hogwarts. But that's one of the it's few always times glowy. of year I would rather be indoors. <laughs> Not much for the cold, are you? Oh, 
I do not mind the cold so much, but it has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around snow. I don't mind me, people. Oh, wait, over here. What's I the situation? often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Interesting. Interesting. All right, people. Out the way. We got a job to do. Got to get my stuff back. Uh -oh. Look, from the forbidden forest, hippogriffs. I wonder if something startled them. Hippogriffs. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. Are uh, they friendly? They seem friendly. I think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs. Absolutely. Right. So this is the part of the areas that we're never going to probably see in movies. That's the forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. Why, Why is, is it off limits? limits? Yes, I was going to ask the, the same question. The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Yeah, ah, there's Hogsmeade over the crest. Yeah, I kind of want to go movie. there. Seems like a lot of fun. Man, this is, this is freaking cool. We'll never get to see this in the form of any movies. I would spend all of my time so exploring if I could. So we could actually explore Hogwarts. I confess, I was entirely. surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that? Hmm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. Okay, that was some weird animation clips right there. The guys. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Mushroom. Sorry, man. I took I took one of the friends. <laughs> Seems like pretty cruel. Those mushrooms like right away. And I took one of the friends. Yeah, you're coming to my potion you? craft. I remember the weeks that followed my arrival, feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. Holy shit, this place I'm getting is big. Used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my homeland, but it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. Nice. That's it. The game looks nice. It looks good. Okay, that's probably our icon we don't want to go to yet. Mr. Moon! <laughs> he is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. <gasps> Mr. Moon. Hello, Mr. Moon. Okay, there, Have buddy. you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss on I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? That oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon... <gasps> Jimmy, guys, ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. He's like, see ya, have fun. Oh, Mr. Moon, <laughs> a demigod. I think he had too much fun the in the village. heck is a guys. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. I say I never did. I don't know the lore. There is much to see outside Shit. of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. Ooh. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Ooh. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. Lots of areas to go. Mind, oh, there's Hogsmeade. Nice. So pretty much the whole entire village of itself. Look at this. This is fantastic. What the heck? I did went to the recent Renaissance Fair last week, and this is definitely going to be back some memories of going to the Renaissance Fair. It's also my first time going to the Renaissance Fair as well, and it was fantastic. Especially with the tournament Jossin that they have going on. It is hard to cool. know where to start. Brings back a the lot of memories. The Green Sticks is the place for Butterbeer. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. Oh yeah, that means a lot of side missions to do. <laughs> oh, Professor we go. Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcraft, some seeds, and a new wand. Of course, you will enjoy, Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. 
you should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience hugs meet at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Oh, well, I will take Enjoy my time. Yourself. I will see you soon. I would absolutely take my time. Hogsby Village has been with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using your guild map. Yes, I will do that, Ashley, because... Whoa, look at this. So, yeah, look, we can change up how we look with the hairstyle. Joke shop. Broomstick. Uh, we got Hogshead. That's the pub and inn. A magic nip. That's a potion. Uh, food, seeds, fertilizer, and potion. That's the way we gotta stop by. I ran an oatmeal and hogs made. Uh, honey dukes. Sounds interesting. Uh, well, we definitely need to go to the wand guy. If we can find where we need to go, that is. Oh, it's, which is right. Right here, Ashley. Maybe close by, Ashley. Oliver's. So, yeah, we definitely need to go here and get a new wand. Uh, is this where we go? Yes. Don't mind me taking money. <laughs> oh, Alright, don't mind me. Spin that. Rebellion. Oh. Uh, where's that field? Oh, it's outside. Okay, hold up. Let me go outside and get this. Oliver's Wand Shot. Wands of a very of woods and all manner of flexibility, each possessing one of the three magical coins. Choose their owners in this cozy clutter shop run by the amenable and knowledgeable Gilbert Oliver. In the profession of wand craft since 382 BC, the Oliver family are considered the best wand makers in Britain, if not the world. Ooh, that's a big claim right there. Extremely big claim. I mean, is that? I think it's time to meet Mr. Olive, uh, Olive Enders. I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah, mm. hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Olivanders, the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Olivanders, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes. Mm, powerful core. Ten and a half inches? Hmm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps, yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Oh shit, here we go. Ooh. Okay, we can customize it, looks like. That's pretty cool. All right, excellent. 
Uh, how are we gonna want our wine to look like, huh? How Let's intriguing. Hmm. They have a classic one brown. Okay, pretty cool. Spiral, stuck honey brown. Curious indeed. Crooked sparrow, natural. No, let's stick with the wind brown. Uh, let's keep it classic How dark brown. Wood type. Ooh, wow, we can actually. Uh, Curious not indeed. I'm not sure this will make a difference. Uh, I'm not sure I'm awake. <laughs> How intriguing. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure I'm doing the right choice here. Ooh, Dragon Strain. Dragon Hushin that serves the core of a one for producing powerful magic, consistent magic, great range of magic. Mm, powerful magic. A Dragon magic. Heartstring Wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Powerful. What oh, do you think? I'm hoping I'm making a wet decision here. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sense a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Nice. Got our first one. I'm not sure I made the right decisions though. We'll find out <laughs> momentarily as we test them out. All right, so we need to visit tombs and scrolls. All right, let's take a look at the map, so. Tombs and squirrels, that's where we gotta hit. Which is just down here, it looks like. So we head down there. Right, I'm gonna assume there's gonna be a lot of stuff. Here. Gonna be a lot of stuff here to find. Oh, we're going the wrong way. Lots of locked doors here. We are definitely not gonna be able to get to here. Uh, we'll be taking that, though. <laughs> Take that guy's uh, lady's money, <laughs> don't mind me. <laughs> Alright, let's unlock some of the fast travel points here, though. Did you got anything to say? Indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Hey. Rebellion. Alright, so can't get in there, obviously. Uh, don't mind me. Okay. There is a door right here. Huh. What happened is if I repair it. see nothing. Lumos. Okay. Butterfly is nearby. It's gonna be out in the boonies, looks like. Some sort of a uh, refuel uh, concrete wall right there. Okay, good to know. Rebellion. That's our clue. Actually, we might be a lot closer than we look, actually. How do Akio repair it? Yeah, this, I don't know. Lumos. Yeah, I don't know how to open this one specifically. I guess we'll find out some other way. All right. It's a pretty big area. I'm kind of walking out in the boonies Rebellion. here. Man, this game is pretty looking though, I'm not gonna lie. This is definitely a really pretty looking game. And it runs so good. What the hell is that? Nice. 
Do a dared page. Chocolate frogs? Chocolate frogs? Likely left behind by a Hogwarts student visiting Hogsmeade. This enchanted uh, confections hop around like real frogs, and each comes with a collectible card for your famous witch or wizard. All right, Ooh, we're almost level five there, everybody. How do I unlock you? How? Tell me. Okay. Whoa! Look at that. Wow. Now that's freaking crazy. Rebellion. Now that's freaking. That's freaking cool right there. Chickens! Some weird chicken. Okay, bag. Ooh, we got some new glasses. Oh, good dokes. Oh, hey, hey, get over here. Hey, we got all the field flying pages and hogs made. Nice. Okay. Oh, let me try to hide this chest. Wiggle weed potion. I think I should know here. Leech juice. Ew! Ew! Leech? Why the hell does leech hair? That's Rebellion. nasty. That's some nasty shit. Can I go to here? Nope, I cannot. Whoa! Okay, I did not realize you could go a lot further. They wouldn't call this game open world for a reason. Okay. Let's try not to break our legs. Oh, oh there's some minor parkour. Okay. I did not expect that. Ooh, so. Don't mind me spending that. <laughs> All right. Oh, flying pages. Come over here. Nice. Thank you. Doors locked. Rebellion. Yeah, there is a lot of stuff in here. All right. An inquiring mind. Ooh. Enchanted staircase. The enchanted staircase and tombs of school reveals itself when a particular brick is moved. But the papaya hair, Thomas Brown, styles of variety of written products, including spellcrafts, handy for conjuration. Ooh. All right. Let's talk to uh, Mr. Thomas here, uh, Mr. Brown. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here, Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course. And you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I too see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Ooh, we can Let's make our own what we stuff, have, shall we? Nice. Do got some money. Looks like this is all going to be free. But all this other stuff are definitely not going to be free. So let's buy the pine table with a small pot sparecraft. Boom. Small potion uh, station sparecraft. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Oh, we cannot afford any of this. The cheapest one is 400 and we can't even afford that. I like the ability to conjure a potting table with three small pots. Use it uh, pot to grow all sorts of useful magical plant. Sounds useful. Again, I cannot afford any of this. Cannot afford that, unfortunately. So we have to come back in when we're not poor. Nice, I like that. Rebellion. Okay. And direct this. Oh. 
Whoa, whoa! There, you know, that was a date. Can we go to the other side of there? I hope you don't mind. Oh, ah, give me that. You try to hide from me. Okay, like I said, we are Rebellion. uncharted territory. Ooh, chess. A skeleton of some sort. The money. I see there are a lot of stuff back there. I'm not sure we are allowed to go back there. I don't think it won't take that kindly for us to just go around him, you know. We, we, we're we going to try. We're going to try. Are we good? Are we good here, Mr. Professor? I guess we are good. I guess we are good. Be taking this, this stuff. <laughs> Lumos. All right, so we can't open the big one here. Revelio. I guess he didn't mind for us to come back here and take his stuff. <laughs> I will be like, hey, what you doing back there, son? Whoa. All right, now we gotta go to the potions shop. That is gonna be over here, which is not too far. Excellent. Ooh, I knew you had something. Kudrin's Precurious Cauldrons. This peculiarly stacked set of cauldrons outside Kudrin's adversary, the shop's wares. It should be noted that stacking cauldron in this fashion while merely eye catching is ill advised for anyone wishing to brew a portion of any attendant effect. Yeah, good. <laughs> That's probably not a good idea, to be honest. Uh, you know, let's go over here. Can't unlock any of these locks. And I unlock any of this. Oh, we got a flying page. Flying page. Come over here. Nice. And we got another mirror here too. Looks like. Lumos. Okay, it's on the uh, on the stairs. There's a chest in front of that stairs as well. We've got a barrel. Looks like it's at the pub, potentially. That's my guess. Again, we still gotta find that other one as well. Rebellion. Oh, we have found a butterfly. Okay, so this is the one we're looking for, Ashley. It's pretty easy. We got a lot of stuff, Ashley. We'll get to you momentarily. Get the chest here. And... Alright, let's get this butterfly to where it supposed to belong. Lumos. Hey, follow me. It's time for you to belong to your friends. Alright, over here. Uh, huh. Alright, back here. Nice. Hey! Build our page. Nice, we leveled up, more health. Awesome. We still have to find that other one at the outskirts somewhere. Alright, so potions is here. Kinda looks like I might have to go up. Don't mind me eating the apples. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry about that. Oh. What are you? What are you doing? Get! Akira. Nice. Got more of those chests. I'm not sure how you do with those ones. Rebellion. Oh, fast travel. Let's cut that up a little bit. Nice. How nice to see you, my young friend. Hey, nice to see my you too. Okay, we've got a lot of places to explore here, everybody. Oh! Akira. You try to hide. Okay. We're definitely getting sidetracked in here. Hey! Pretty nice trick. Get that. Let's mess with that. <laughs> Alright, let's get our potion supply, shall we? Welcome to Jib Hello. Potions. Don't mind me if I search to this. Oh, we got a field guide. Get that. 
Uh, Jade Pippin's Potion. Jade Pippin's Potion established in 1753 is the apocryphy in Hogsmeade where proprietary, uh, proprietors Perry Pippin sells a wide variety of potions and the ingredients. Uh, let's talk to him. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art to potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Oh, ooh, ooh, What nice. can I do for you today? All right, obviously we need to. A Darius potion recipe that causes a rocky film to develop on the consumer's skin, helping to protect it from harm. Okay, so rock skin, take that. Obviously, the Wiggle Weird World as healing potion. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Well, not, I'm not in a rush, but I can't afford any of this stuff. <laughs> of course, we got some uh, ingredients here we can use to uh, make some potions here, too. Or we could buy ready made potions, which we cannot afford because we are broke. Or we could afford some health potions, but I'm, I'm thinking we could. Oh, we should probably start equipping this stuff, Ashley. All right, there we go. Who's Rebellion. Nice, nice, nice. Whoa, what are you? Where the heck you came from? All right. Well, before we do that, uh, let's uh, let's equip some of that gear, Ashley. Uh, we did got some new stuff. Thank you. 